morning, good morning. It's Jilly Cave from the Sunshine Coast. <coughs> oh, Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia, on a very crisp winter morning, but um, we're only down to 15 degrees Celsius, but it kind of feels cold for us because we have a pretty temperate climate in Queensland. So, so, I am going to do a um, blow and kiss or Dutch pour and Aussie kiss. I have tried to thin my paints down a lot more than I normally do. So I'm gonna see if uh, <laughs> it works for me. I am using some of the Montmartre Studio acrylics, but I've also got some left over here, just a little bit of the Boom Gel uh, rubber bottle. The boom, the boom Gel stain. So it's just a pouring paint that creates a bloom effect without you doing anything to it. So I, I have done a previous video and I have a little bit of the colours, well just the two. So what I've done is I have just added water to them because it seems to be the mistake I keep making with doing the blowing around the canvas is always my paints are too thick and so they won't blow anywhere. So I have um, watered down said paints and I'm going to try once again. So this was just white that I added a bit of, what colour was it I added? I think it was just a bit of the turquoise that was left in the bottom and it's just got this sort of whitey turquoise colour on it. So let me see if it runs down the canvas because otherwise then I know I think it's still too thick so I'm just adding water to it everybody tells me that the paints have got to be really thin and I just couldn't bring myself to take them that that thin in case it uh, ruined the dexterity of the paints I suppose I was kind of just thinking oh no if you take them that thin surely they're going to crack or they're just going to be so transparent like see-through on the canvas but I don't know so still quite thick oh, I can't seem to have it in me to water paint stand that are so thin I just um, don't seem to be able to be in my DNA or whatever they Oh, look at that lacing. That must have had a bit of the black. Um, <laughs> that's cool. Had a bit of the black uh, boom gel stain in it because that is made to just create lacing effect and a bloom effect without having to actually do anything. It's just uh, without having to add all the ingredients and so on and so forth. It is available in the US and um, United Kingdom and Europe. Um, as is all of these products so I'm going to have to try and find somebody in the US that will give me um, an affiliate link for you all so when you're buying it you get ah, oh, poopy do what am I doing I never stirred it in I'm stirring Stanley so it still doesn't look as thin as, and I just don't want to risk it because I know that you all say you have to, that's just the style of it. So without further ado, I'm going to try just these colours that I tried first off anyway, the other day, um, was, I'm going to just, oh, I'll put it on a bed of paint, that might be better, because I'm going to blow it up from the bottom. Okay, so this is just the black in the boom gel stain. So we will see. Oh, this is probably too thick again. But anyway, I'm gonna just go with the flow. This is the gold in the boom gel stain. It is a lovely gold too. So we'll just see what it does here. No. Less is best, I keep having to remind myself with this kind of painting, I think. 
So, and this is the uh, native violet in the boom gel again. So I will put some more gold in that. I'm just gonna stick with the two colors because I did it the other day uh, in another artwork and it seemed to be really attractive in the two colors instead of me like I always go overboard and wanna add every color under the sun because I'm a just color fanatic. So this is obviously going to have some negative space. So I'll get my hairdryer, which I'm going to use to blow this. I could use my little um, mini blower, my or an airbrush, which I'll, I have to have another go at in the near future again with all the other 50,000 projects that I want to achieve. So here we go. I just. That already. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh no I'm oh. <laughs> oh look at that lighting. But I've lost all the deep colour. I have to do some more back the other way. Oh, give me. See, this is what I've done now. I've added too much of the base coat and it's, it's sort of watered out all those gorgeous colours. So I'll just give it some more. Give it some more. Why not? I'm not adding any more white to this or that pale greeny colour. Let's do this again. Let me try blowing upwards and downwards. I see I didn't think it'd go that far. That's got crazy lazy. Again. Oh my goodness, when will I learn? When will I learn? Might as well do it now, I've done it. <laughs> Got all over the canvas. Still want some more. I want more, more, more. Got plenty of gold. Well, that could have done a really big canvas with what I've done. So you obviously, as everybody keeps telling me, more uh, less is best, less is best, and then just blow it out because I wanted to have some negative space, but that obviously hasn't happened. But what it's showing me is it would be really good to blow it out for lacing on a bigger canvas because look at all this lacing you get from the boom gel. So let me try it again. like that. I do like it. There's just too much paint there. Rises, rises. <coughs> <coughs> oh gee, I need a drink. I do like that. 
That is nice. Ooh, well, I'm gonna, now it's give me some ideas. I wanna get a big canvas and I'll only need a tiny bit of the boom to spread it, but wow. I was gonna add my little teeny tiny balloon to do the kiss and blow, but I actually like it just like that. So I've done the blow. I'll, I'll just see what my teeny tiny balloon, just teeny tiny. <coughs> Oh dear, I have to get a drink, I have to get a drink. I'm back, just had a bit of a coughing fit, I don't know what it is. The weather, we've got a lot of pollen flying around because of the really windy weather. Anyway, um, I just did a few teeny tiny uh, balloon kisses through there, but I just really like the softness about it and I love those colours together so please let me know what you think it's a little bit soft and delicate for me um, and I'm not soft and delicate but anyway uh, you try a bit of everything so thanks so much suppliers and the link um, below this video